Ladies and gentlemen, from the full-on Muay Thai, we now move to mixed martial arts. Ladies and gentlemen, Don Wilkin. With a fight record of one win and two losses, this is his debut on the mixed martial arts circuit. Ladies and gentlemen, Miselo Babani. Your referee for this fight, Mr. Lester Lombard. All right, so we have our first MMA fight of uh, this evening at the UMF. Uh, Dragon Legends Fight Night. I'm here with Luca, our MMA expert, and he's going to be talking us through what's going on in the ring during this MMA fight. Uh, so to kick it off, fighting out of the blue corner, we've got Don Wilkin. He's age 24. He's weighing in at 61.9 kilograms. Uh, he's got a fight record of nine fights, five wins, and four losses. We got uh, from Cape Town, Selo Mbane. He's 63.5 kilo. He has three fights, one win, two loss. There we go. So the fighters touch gloves. There's a good kick by Don. Uh, Don is a good ground fighter. He's a very experienced fighter. Uh, his takedowns are really good. I don't know much about uh, Selo. I've never seen him fight before. Masem Selo and Don both are looking very, very ripped, very lean, extremely fit guys. Uh. Yes, I know that um, Don has dropped uh, at least uh, uh, seven or eight kilos. When I fought him, he was uh, 69, 70 kilos, and he weighed now at 61. So definitely a drop there on the, in the division. Huge weight difference there, and uh, obviously come down in category. Maybe gained a little bit of speed and power for his size. As you see, he's a good wrestler. He's got very good takedowns. His ground game is very good. And I think that at this weight, he'll do really, really well. He's in side control now. He's working. He's working at knee on the belly. He's looking very tight. Probably going to go and look to go into the mount. Selo is defending well. There we go, he's into the mount now. And, and if he stays tight here, yeah, he should be working some ground and pound. Good shot there from Dunn to the midsection. Another good shot there to the head. He's going to push his head away now and work some punches. Some seal is still trying to stay as close as possible to avoid being punched out early on. No, he's doing well to hold on and uh, try to avoid damage. And uh, that's it. It's just that's it. He might just turn him now. Well done. Very tight guillotine, standing guillotine. That looks really, really tight. Very good escape. Uh, by great, yeah, absolutely. Great work by Marcelo to actually get out of that guillotine. Yeah, it looked that, that, uh, very solid. That, that, that looked very tight. Um, now Don is working to go into side control again. again there we go. And now into the mount again. Working the ground and pound. Landed one or two shots there. I think uh, Don has a slight advantage on the ground, but uh, Miselo definitely doing the job to defend well. There we go, he swept him again, but he might got into a triangle this time. He is defending that well as well, but the triangle also looks quite tight. He's stacking him up and the round, saved by the ball. Well done, both of them. What a fantastic first round there. Good display of technique by both fighters. Don may be looking a little bit stronger um, with the side control and then the mount as well. But Marcelo doing a fantastic job there to defend right through right through the first round. He definitely defended well. Uh, Don at the edge there by mounting him twice. Um, both the guillotine and the triangle attempt, they were both really tight. 
I'll definitely give him the round. Got our ring girl signaling that uh, next round up is round two. Coaches in the corners giving their fighters some advice. Um, Luca, what do you think Mcelo's corner is telling him right now? I think Mcelo needs to keep this fight standing and uh, avoid the take dance. I think Dan's going to look at taking this back to the ground as soon as possible. And round two is on. The fighters touch gloves. And the crowd quiet in anticipation. by Marcelo, he definitely needs to keep this fight standing. Looks like he has an edge, and there we go. There, there's a wrestling, big slam. Huge slam by Don, and straight into side control. He's working hard for that. Very good, very good by Don. Straight into side control there. It was a nice bit of stand-up fighting there to start off the round as well. Exceptional speed by both these fighters with the legs. very fast and um, Don capitalized uh, with uh, Micello coming in and uh, ducked for a takedown and <laughs> ended up slamming him out. He's enough guard now. I must say Don landing a few cheeky shots there and uh, that will be wearing Micello down. Don should try and capitalize on these positions that he has and uh, try and make more damage and to be a little bit easier. But a great sweep by Micello. Well, we've seen a couple of those. He's been, his sweeps are really, really good. He's now in off guard. Let's see if he's going to be busy on top and do some damage. Amazing to see how the fight can turn around within, within moments. couple of MFs, very good defending by Don as well, he's moving his hips well, trying to escape and trying to so keep that off guard. Also interesting how Marcelo's blocked uh, Don's hand, trying to keep his arm out the way with the knee. Yes, but he's given away that off guard and now Don is uh, almost in uh, full guard again. And uh, Marcelo should be careful by some submission from his back. Go. There's another very good sweep by Don, and this has been back and forth. And now Don should throw a couple of punches there. Don looking for a ground and pound right now, and both uh, Don stands up and fighters back on their feet. Very nice back and forth match. Priscilla landing a good left kick, followed up by Don's good kick as well. A bit of respect there at the end of round two. What an incredible round, but. Uh, Bit of stagnant uh, fighting on the ground there with not too much happening. Both fighters looking for position. Yeah, this was a difficult round to score. Uh, I'll maybe give it to Don for that slam that he threw in the beginning of the round. But uh, this was a little bit closer and uh, both sweeping each other. And very good. Very matched. Yeah, that's right, uh, Luca. That was a big slam early on in the fight. That could have also hurt Marcelo a little bit, but um, Marcelo came back really strong. Uh, we have Lester now calling the fighters. That uh, time's up. They need to get out of the corners. Coaches get out of the rings. And um, yeah, this come back. Should, this should be a good round. As, uh, you know, the guys are a little bit tired. Maybe, maybe their technique will come out a little bit more, and uh, we'll see even a better round. Well, this is the final round, so we could determine the winner within this round. Definitely, the fight's still open and uh, anybody can take it. 
Oh, very good. Great kick. kick there by Marcelo to the air. Fantastic, and uh, Don shoots for the takedown, and he gets it again. Again, inside control. Marcelo tried to get his guard back from uh, off guard. Got a butterfly on the one side, and he's working a guillotine. But uh, Don is on side control, and it's very difficult to finish guillotine from that position. Don trying to mount again. Ground and pound now. Don looking for. He's uh, looking for the ground and pound, but then uh, step back into. Uh, oh, another almost. Another side there control. Is tight for again. That looks very tight. There we go, tap there out, we Don tap. wins the fight. What a great fight, Don, congratulations. It was some great skill shown by both these fighters. Marcelo, unfortunately, not been able to get out of that Ladies one. and gentlemen, to present our medals, Amanda from Zupi. Gentlemen, your winner, Don Wilkins. Don, congratulations on your win. Was that as easy as it looked? Did it look easy? Very easy. No, it wasn't. He's very fit, very strong. Uh, I felt it a bit, especially in the second round, but uh, I knew it would come. I knew he's going to give it to me, so, you know, finally it happened. Well, congratulations, Don. Thanks, Baron.